Hello everyone. In this session, we're going to take a look at backing up and restoring the Certificate Authority using the Certificate Authority Console. So we're going to click on Tools, Certificate Authority. We want to right click on the CA, Contoso DCCA, click on All Tasks and select Backup CA. Want to click on next on the welcome to the certification authority backup wizard. And we want to select the items that we wish to back up. We're going to select private key. And we're going to select certificate database and certificate database log. If you have performed backups previously, you can choose the perform backup options that you see here. We're going to choose the backup location. So we're going to browse. And we want to backup in a folder on the local drive. Called backup. So we find that folder and select OK. Now we want to click on next to continue. And we see that we can't save in that backup folder because the folder has to be empty. And you see the note here on the dialog box, the backup directory must be empty. So we're going to go to that folder. And we're going to actually empty the backup that's there already for our purposes for this particular lab. And we're going to try again. So we have the C backup, the place where we're going to backup. And then we want to click next. And we're asked for a password. You're going to need that password to gain access to the private key and the CA certificate file. We're going to go ahead and type a password. And click on next to continue and we want to click on finish and you can see that our certificate information has been backed up now we need now we need to restore the items so we're going to right click click on all tasks and we're going to click on restore ca and you're going to get a prompt telling you that Active Directory Certificate Services cannot be running during this operation. Do you want to stop Active Directory Certificate Services now? And yes, we do. You're going to click on OK. You want to click on Next to continue. And we want to select the items shown here because those are the items that we backed up and we wish to restore them. And we're going to find the location. Which is that backup folder. Scroll down a little bit here. There it is. Backup and we're going to click on OK. We want to click next to continue. And we have to type that password that we initially typed to gain access to the data that we had backed up. And we click on finish to complete the restore wizard. So in this session, we took a look at backing up and restoring of the certificate authority. And now we have to restart the Active Directory service. So we want to click on yes.
this is the end of our session and I want to thank you for listening.